we're the most renowned place in the world for growing Sauvignon Blanc, but we've also got uh, so many other activities that we can show our guests. This weekend, is, uh, it's just a wonderful chance to show off how brilliant Marlborough really is. We've got these people coming together from all parts of New Zealand and uh, we're sitting here going, look guys, this is where we play, this is where we have fun. We all just think that it's the wineries, uh, probably because we're in the industry, but it, it's a fantastic place. Just such huge scope to do all sorts of things. The weather has really turned it on for us uh, this weekend. Oh, I think uh, it's a combination of um, just the beautiful scenery, um, just the peacefulness, um, the laid back people, just so down to earth, uh, beautiful place. I guess for me Marlborough is incredibly unique. It's like a, a sort of hidden piece of paradise. The weather is gorgeous, the people are lovely, you've got um, spectacular scenery like out in the sounds here and it really does feel like you're discovering a little treasure, I suppose. Marlborough does have the most sunshine hours in New Zealand and we rely on that. So uh, this weekend's been fabulous, yeah. We've caught some fish, including some huge kingfish, which uh, are always uh, exciting, not only for the person who's catching the fish, but for those on board seeing the power of, uh, of a 50 pound or 60 pound kingfish. The variety of fish you can catch here is just immense. Uh, every time over the side, straight into the bites, um, and nobody out there, what a, what a place. Absolutely stunning place. It's pretty special, pretty lucky to be able to come to this sort of place. So uh, yeah, wow, blows your, blows your mind. You just look at it, it's brilliant.